Morning guys, we're driving to Denmark, but we have to pick up something first and food. That stuff is so good. And this is just a uh, roll and it's huge and that's what she said. Seriously though, nothing beats this. This is super fresh and numbs you. Nom, 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 nom. This is the kind you need to get. Cool. Crusty and soft on the inside, but tasty. Mm, I think it can work. We had like a half hour before <laughs> we had to go, so I didn't get enough time to actually get breakfast. First time, by the way, that I'm getting breakfast because I am super hungry after yesterday. Because we had amazing pizza, which filled me up entirely up till the evening. And that's, that's saying a lot about the food. If I'm not hungry half hour later, the food was good. Same like the burger the day before, I was full the entire day. Also a good thing. That is how German autobahns look like because lorries are not allowed, or trucks, how you call them, are not allowed to drive on the other lane, so they are standing in one line, <laughs> sometimes yeah. moving. I've so been here for how long? A couple of days. <laughs> and I've eaten more McDonald's than I have in the last four months. <laughs> Even in the US, we didn't go that often. We didn't ever. We never. we never actually went. So. But it is better here. It is, that, that it is, is better. That is true though. The uh, European anything is usually better. I need to pee. That's something I didn't need to know. You're welcome. <laughs> I love her. That's what you get at McDonald's Germany. Fancy. And vegetarian. It's okay. No, I'm not. We had my cousins. This is her cat. She's a mixture out of Nero and Sina. Perfect kitty. The weather here is really ugly. Ooh. I keep saying that you just totally jinxed everything earlier by saying, no, no it's, it's ready, but it's not. By the way, Nuremberg. Yeah. It's pretty. <laughs> it is pretty. We're going to a burger place that's a bit rockabilly and things. Another day, another beer. Today we have. Tendo. Calabia. Tendo. Tendo. Okay, guys, one sec. You're blurry. <laughs> Much. Yeah, yeah, they were dirty. But uh, it's very tasty. I like it. So basically, so far, every single day I've, I've drank German beer. Good on me. Look, there is creamy root beer with real sugar. Wait, where is it? And this is. No, 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 no. <laughs> Do you get this in America, bro? I don't think so. Because that's impossible to get anything natural. And it's pretty much impossible to find anything without high fructose syrup. Cool thing about this place next to the decor in the background is you can customize your own burger and it actually says it in English customize your own burger. The rest is obviously German, but they have so much stuff going on. And here's the meat portion we're here. This looks amazing. It does. And oh. look at the fries. Look at the fries. That's cool. Proper food. They also didn't accept cards. Which is kind of weird. Like menus, they didn't accept cards. And I want to show you the map real quick. Tomorrow we will discover Nuremberg. We're basically in the middle of Nuremberg right now. This is the area where they have the Chris Kettle Market. So there's a church. <laughs> there is. Was that the top bit of a church? What? Was that the top of a church or was it always like this? No, it's a fun thing from the Romans. Really? It's, it's now one of camera. the oldest stuff here in Nuremberg. Awesome. It's, it's, I think, thousand years old. Wow. Something that I totally knew myself, and I didn't get it from our awesome tour guide, is that over there is a very nice church, and the Nazis stole uh, the spear that they poked Christ with. Okay. That's what I know. Uh, nothing I want, more? Well, they poked him with it, and they kept it here, because and that's where the, Nazis. And that's where the term poking comes from, right? I guess so, yeah. It that's, was invented in Nuremberg. You, you can totally Google that stuff, though. Just yeah, saying. You, you will do it. You will do it. <laughs> oh my god, that is a Starbucks. I didn't really see that. This is so cool. So, um, oh, <coughs> from our tour guide. not tour guide that I did, I knew wait, 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 myself. Wait, wait, wait. So, we have to, we need the right background. Okay, now. Since today is not a good day, you can look over there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think that's something important. You can look over here because tomorrow we can make good pictures here. <laughs> so that, it's just for show. That's, that's all it is. 
That's for tomorrow, but not, not now. <laughs> yeah, so now we go that way. Awesome. I think that's new. And they just took down something there. And our amazing tour guide has Hi, a new story. Back. We're going to talk about a little bit of history here because our totally not tour guide that is standing over there. No, ignore him, ignore him. He's not giving any information. One sec. I'm that popular. Anyways, like if you can see over there, there is a very nice bridge. Uh, let's just come, come there. over there. You can see a bridge. In the Middle Ages, they used that to basically torture people because there is a story going that a baker actually was baking smaller breads than he was advertising. We all know this problem. Basically, they drowned him in a cage. It's shitty, but he should have baked bigger breads. I should totally have listened to this story. I think he altered it. And look, it is popular even here. The only problem is you have no idea if I'm actually telling the so, truth. That's what I basically said right now. Yeah. I think he was talking bullshit. Nope. <laughs> I think I said the same. <laughs> if you need a dental or lederhosen, you can come here. It's very expensive though. We just were in a bar called Monastery Kloster. And there were two guys next to us and I thought they were actually German. They started to talk and one of them actually was more like a, a smooth hipster, if that makes sense. Or he could be Swedish, I don't know. So anyhow, I thought they actually talked German. All of a sudden I heard English and I'm like, huh, that's weird. And the right guy, I was thinking he's German because he threw in a lot of complicated German words where he didn't know the English word and he explained it. So then my cousin said, seems like he knows Montreal, so she thinks he's actually not German. And then <laughs> her boyfriend just said, he recognizes a guy with a beard. And he actually is a drummer from a band he saw. So the right guy obviously was a drummer, which explains that he could be in Montreal. <laughs> and was it the other guy's guy he was talking about? Um, he apparently is also in a band. So <laughs> in the end, we probably should have asked. And she got and we're like, hmm, we should listen into the conversation more. Being bad human beings, basically. Yeah. And now we are sending Jure over the bridge. Okay. <laughs> Michelle, what are you doing? <laughs> I have a crazy person as a cousin. From our not to guy, we should totally not pay attention to. This is basically one of the first bridges that uh, has that going on. Obviously, it's not the real thing anymore because, well, it's really old. It is. Shh, shh. Hey. It's the first chain bridge. Yeah, what she said. I totally know that though. <laughs> Walk. Yeah, you can see it's nice, it's sturdy. I can jump on it, so I'm fine. Bye, Yoru! It's not the season yet, but you do have a lot of beer garden things around here. And of course, like the old buildings. Stop yes? Talk to yourself, crazy woman. <laughs> There's the guy who's running around with a camera too. Last time it's called Manhari after her. Yeah. And it's seriously just a yeah. And they have a trick here that tastes like ice cream but it's alcohol. And I need him to try it. Okay. You're very rude. You never say good night to the people on the internet here. You're disgusting. I may or may not have just fired. Say good night. Good night. No, like you normally do. Hmm? Like you normally do. Good night. It doesn't matter where you are. Oh. Good night. Doesn't matter where you are. As long as you have an awesome day. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye guys.